Harnessing Fusion 360's generative workspace might sound like a challenge. After all, its ability to connect design, simulation, and manufacturing into one is like nothing before. But it starts simply with framing the problem. Using the Edit Model workspace, designers can simplify geometry, remove unnecessary parts, and create new bodies specific to the generative setup, such as fasteners and tool clearances. From there, the remaining geometry will be designated as either preserve or obstacle regions. Then, load cases representing the real-world loading conditions and materials are defined, and used to weigh the results against an objective to lightweight or create the stiffest part possible. From there, the manufacturing constraints are defined. Will you use a 5-axis, a 3-axis, or additive manufacturing process, or other? These definitions will account for how you take that digital model into a tangible asset. With that, Fusion 360 is armed with all the information needed to generate hundreds of optimized solutions. Blink and you'll miss these simple steps. All this and more in Fusion 360.